This morning, the Trump administration is continuing to face heat over its zero tolerance policy with immigration. Adults who cross the border illegally can be prosecuted and separated from their children. KBOI 2's Lauren Clark tells us what Congress and the president are planning to do to fix the issue. Well, Denny and Brian, both Republicans and Democrats are pointing the finger at each other, saying the other needs to compromise for a deal. Homeland Security Secretary Kristen Nielsen says the administration is wanting to protect the children and is calling on Congress to act. Now, the Associated Press is reporting that babies and other young children who have been separated from their parents are sent to at least three so-called tender age shelters in South Texas. Medical providers who have visited say the facilities are safe and clean, yet the children are often crying and acting out. Pope Francis is the latest leader to criticize the administration on this policy, saying it's immoral and contrary to Catholic values. As the outrage of the situation continues, President Trump made his way over to Capitol Hill to meet with members of his party on potential immigration bills. These are laws that have been broken for many years, decades, but we had a great meeting. Still, it remains unclear if a bill makes it out of the House if it would receive enough Democratic support to pass. Members of both parties are suggesting this problem can be solved with a presidential order and are calling on President Trump to sign one right away. The president alone can fix it with this flick of a pen by signing a presidential order to end the agonizing screams of small children who have been separated from their parents. Now, currently, both Republicans and Democrats are looking for a pair of different boat votes for immigration bills. Both address family se separation issues to a certain degree while strengthening border security and making other changes to the system. Reporting here in the studio, Lauren Clark, KBOI 2 News. Boise's mayor and city council are weighing in on the separating of illegal immigrant families at the border. They passed a resolution calling on Idaho's congressional delegation to put a stop to it, calling it un-American. Yesterday, before the council passed its resolution, Senators Jim Risch and Mike Crapo signed on as co-sponsors of a Senate bill to end the policy.